Podcast. What's going on, guys? This is the Big Puma, and when Lord Display comes up in this bitch, he says, What's going on? Be ready. Welcome to Reliance Stadium. Houston Texans taking on the Atlanta Falcons. See Matt Ryan's stats 2,600 yards, 18 touchdowns, 8 interceptions. They did get the ball first. Here it is, third and eight. And he gets it knocked down right there by J.J. Watt before getting sacked. Or not sacked, just knocked down. Matt Schaub, 1,700 yards, 14 touchdowns, 8 interceptions. First and 10. And Arian Foster busts loose with that big handoff there. He just bounces off. He makes touchdowns. That's what he does. 42 yards for the touchdown there. Second and 10 for the Falcons. Five minutes in the first quarter. And Matt Ryan slings it into Roddy White between three defenders and gets a first down. Second and three. Brian Cushing is not having that. He says, you stay back there. Matt Schaub gets sacked by Corey Peters in the backfield. Makes it third and 19. They end up punting. Matt Ryan hands it off. To, there's too many Matts in this one. Hands it off to Michael Turner who runs it up the gut. Gets a nice first down. 44 seconds left. Jones in motion. Ryan looking for a receiver. Dumps it off to Turner who lunges forward. Gets a first down but he gets injured and that's going to be the end of our first quarter. The Texans are up 7-0. to Got the stadium closed. Looks a little cloudy out there. But coming into the second quarter, it is second and six. They have made it up to the six-yard line. Snelling runs it in for a touchdown as he takes the place of Michael Turner. And on second and 13, Matt Schaub hands it off to Arian Foster, who gets out there. Two rushes, 60 yards. Foster in motion on second and 10, three minutes and 28 seconds. Schaub looking and throws it before he gets hit. Right in Arian Foster's bread basket. It is 14 to seven. Second and six. Two minutes and 47 seconds left for the Falcons. Matt Ryan gets it out there to Tony Gonzalez. Huge first down, 19 yards. Matt Ryan in the shotgun with two minutes left. Again to Tony Gonzalez. And it's going to take three Texans to get him down. Second and seven, minute 15 left. Matt Ryan hands it off to Turner who has come back. And right here he goes out for good this time. He's got broken ribs. He is out for two weeks. Snelling in the backfield here. Minute and 11 seconds left. Ryan looking downfield. And he can't get away from J.J. Watt. J.J. Watt is probably going to be the defender of the year, defensive player of the year. Because look at that. He gets over Snelling. Can't block the J.J. Watt. They go for their field goal on 4th and 17. There's a flag thrown on the Texans. Jason Allen comes off sides, and that's going to give them 5 yards. They decline it, get the field goal. It is 14 to 10. Texans are up. Two seconds left. Handed off to Arian Foster who uses his blocks very well before getting knocked out of bounds. And that's going to take us to halftime. Texans are up 14-10. to 10. Looks like they got some different cheerleaders. That's great. Second and six, the quarter has just started. Matt Schaub chunks it out there to Kevin Walter, who caught that pass two games ago to send the Texans to their first playoff game in franchise history. Arian Foster had a big part in that. You see that big rush. Six rushes, 117 yards. That is absolutely ridiculous. Matt Schaub looking downfield. Can't find a receiver. Gets sacked. Drops the ball, but lucky for him, his fellow teammate picks it up. Matt Schaub throws it down the field on third and 20 to Andre Johnson. 25 yards. That is his first reception of the game. Two minutes and 50 seconds left. Going downfield with it to Andre Johnson. Did he get it in? In the corner, he says yes. Referee says no, he did not get it in. Texans, here they are, third and seven after that play. Schaub looking, and for whatever reason, decides to run. Actually loses yards. They have to settle for the field goal. Texans are now up 17 to 10. Matt Ryan hands it off to Jason Snelling, who just bounces around through the in middle. Runs it straight up the gut, out to the left. And that is going to tie the game 17 to 17. And that's the end of the third quarter. The Falcons have brought it back on the Texans. That is a nice looking stadium. Even though the logo has changed, it still looks good. Shaw back. He throws it down there to Kevin Walter. Does a little spin move before getting down at the 40-yard line. Four and a half minutes left. Shaw looking. Gets it to Walter again. Another spin move. And he's going to be brought down around the 18. Four minutes left. And Kevin Walter again. Did he bring it in? 
They say yes, he did. Let's take a look at the replay for this one. We see we're focused here on Kevin Walter. Gets it behind the defender who goes nowhere. And Kevin Walter gets both feet in. Great job for Kevin Walter. 24-17, to the Texans are up. Matt Ryan drops back, throws it out to Julius Jones. Julio Jones, I'm sorry. Two receptions, 27 yards. Three minutes left again to Julio Jones before getting taken down around the 40-yard line. Second and 10 with two minutes left. D'Amico Ryans gets a big sack on Matt Ryan, and he has a mini seizure right there. Third and 17 with two minutes left in the game. Matt Ryan back, somehow manages to not get sacked, and gets it out to Roddy White. Of course, Kareem Jackson is the defender and causes this. Harry Douglas gets a touchdown, his first reception of the game. Coach is happy. Minute left, the game is tied up. Matt Schaub throws it downfield and squeezes it into Andre Johnson for his second catch of the game. Schaub once again looking downfield. Throws it out to Kevin Walter, but gets intercepted by Hayden, and that is not good for the Texans. Four, 37 seconds left, second and three. Matt Ryan throws it downfield. Jason Allen picks it off before running in the back a little bit, getting tackled. That is good for the Texans. 30 seconds left in the game. The score is tied 24-24. Matt Schaub throws it out there to Andre Johnson to squeeze it in just barely as the defender tries to knock it down. Six seconds left. It's a Hail Mary. Schaub's going to throw it down into the end zone, and it gets batted down. And, fellas, we are going to overtime. Andre Johnson's not happy. This game should have been over. We take a look. Reliance Stadium's getting dark. It is 24 to 24. We get some extra football out of this. So here we go on to the coin toss. Captains meet up in the middle of the field once again. Ref says, you call it in the air. They choose tails, I believe. Come on, flip the coin. It is heads. The Texans won the toss. Of course, they want to receive. And the Falcons are going to defend the left. Let's get this quarter on the road here. First play of the game, Matt Schaub looking for someone to throw it to. Has all the time in the world. Gets it out there to Kevin Walter. Six receptions, 84 yards. It is now second and five with four minutes left. A little screen pass to Arian Foster. Uses his blockers very well. Very nice job by him. Four receptions for 69 yards. First and ten, four minutes left. And Matt Schaub just can't get away. He gets sacked in the backfield. Third and nine now. Three minutes left, gets it out there to Jacoby Jones who gets across the first down marker and this is it. The Texans kick the field goal and get the win in overtime with a minute left, 27 to 24. Everyone's happy, coaches shaking hands. Derek Ward out there who didn't get any playing time, he's shaking hands here. Let's take a look at the player of the game. Arian Foster, 16 yards, 16 carries, I'm sorry, 160 yards and a touchdown. That is going to be it for this game against the Falcons. Thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe and like, and we'll catch you on the flip side. AMF.